89 Plus is a, an international research project uh, co-curated by Hans Ulrich Obrist and Simon Kastitz. Basically, they are interested in kind of mapping a generation of creative people, not just artists, but people that are working uh, in innovation or in kind of creative fields that are born after 1989 because uh, there's a number of theories that there's a distinct shift in generations and how they operate after this time. The move to Switzerland it's quite recent first of all so it's all very new to me. What's actually very important to me is that uh, I'm living and working with a lot of different cultures at the moment. Um, so artists from South America and, and the Middle East and other parts of Africa as well. And so it's, it's been really great for me to get perspective on what, what I bring as a South African into that kind of environment. And so my work has kind of changed a little bit rather than being focused so much on um, issues at play because I think my work is very much about the context that I'm in. And so I'm looking for ways to engage with uh, people and culture in that context. So this is a photograph that I took in 2012 and it's in it's a section of wall in a, in, a, in a district called Jeppie's Town, which kind of straddles Kensington on the way to the city. And it's a very kind of, it's one of the oldest districts in the city, and it's very, very cosmopolitan and quite chaotic at times. And um, basically what's happening in this scene is that the resident of this house got so angry at the amount of people peeing on their wall that they built another wall to kind of really make a stand and say that they've had enough of all the peeing. So, um, and I used to pass by it, uh, taking the bus to and from university, and I saw it every day, and I laughed at it, and I thought it was funny. Um, and I decided to photograph it, because I also thought it could speak very well in its own way of a lot of wider tensions that are playing out continuously within the city. Basically, in this photo, there are two opposing sides, and each side has, its, has their own idea of what is acceptable to do on the street or in public or against someone's wall. And... Um, Johannesburg is a city which is growing rapidly and it's developing all the time, but it's also operating on very, very pronounced uh, divisions between classes. And the middle classes in particular exist largely in isolation from what's happening in the rest of the city. And it's these shifts in perspective in terms of what's acceptable or what's considered beautiful or what's considered desirable that I'm interested in, in working with. So this photograph was a starting point for me. I love working with soap operas because I find them hysterical and I think there's so much like issue, actual issues and stuff that are under the surface and playing out that there's a lot to do, like there's a lot to work with there and so I like to like take things from what's going on around. I definitely hope that there'll be a lot of projects and collaborations in future, I think it'll be really valuable but um, like I say I mean that this project has also only just started so who knows where the road could take us, but what's really exciting is that more and more people will join in uh, as time goes by. And also, I really enjoy that, that they're using platforms like this for 89 Plus, where people can actually have the chance to really reflect on their work and share it with people, and I think that is important as well, not just exhibitions or, or anything. It's like, it's quite a, it really, it's a challenge. And these kind of talks are good sparks for, for good conversations that come after and I think that's super important.